Okay, so, inside our Prius transmission, we have our ring gear, planetary gears are pulled out. This is our sun gear. Sun gear is, is in mesh with or splined onto what? MG1. Okay, MG1. And you can see when we spin the, when we spin the sun gear, the way it kind of wobbles as it stops because it's attached to that big electric motor. Okay. Ring gear right here is attached to what? MG2. Okay, what else is it attached to? Final drive. Okay, all of our final drive. So when we rotate that ring gear, you can see you can see that it, it rotates our final drive gears and our, our differential, which is down here. Okay, so where is our planetaries? Go ahead and stick the, the planetary, the planet carrier is on this shaft. So this shaft here, these splines are splined into what? Okay, essentially the engine. So our drive plate, uh, which is bolted onto the crankshafts, so that's going to go down through there. Just go ahead and kind of spin it. Don't let your fingers get pinched. Oh. Okay. So now it's in. Okay. So that's that's all there is for gears. Would you agree that this is the most complicated part of this Prius transaxle? Uh, yes. Okay. This last piece here that we just put on there, what goes on that? What's going to go on top of uh, top of here? Well, this notch right here is for the little oil pump drive. Grab that rotor. Grab that rotor. You in that rotor? <laughs> Okay, don't let anything stick to it and stick it in there so we can see how that looks. Okay, so this is MG2. MG2 is our primary traction motor. When it spins, you can see the way it turns the whole drivetrain. When MG2 is acting as a generator, then of course our differential is turned by the, the CV axles, which are turned by the wheels and it pushes everything back the other direction. Piece of cake, right? Much, much simpler than a regular automatic transmission, wouldn't you say? Yes. Nothing all that magic. It's, it's kind, of a, kind of an interesting design.